you guys were just in a pretty back and forth matchup there in that uh, that round of 16 game against a team that y'all tied yesterday, so you knew it was going to be like that. And y'all with a late lead trying to cling to it, and they yes, they try and test you on the corner, and you're able to come up with a breakup in the back corner of the end zone. Just take yes, me through that play, kind of pre-snap all the way through it. Now, okay, um, coming in, I had a, a, a messed up assignment, but I know my my teammates was counting on me, so I had to I had to fix myself. So coming in, we was playing cover four, and I, I was the man to make that play. You know, um, they count on me, so I got to do what I got to do. At that point there was pretty little time left, so you had to feel confident the offense was going to be able to kind of run some clock and then close it out. How much excitement and emotion, relief probably after the way the game had been, was just, what was that moment like? It was, it was amazing, man. We, we worked hard. Me and my, my boys, we worked hard for it, so this will pay us back. Getting through yesterday with that being undefeated, you had that one tie, but then came back and won the next two, surviving this back and forth one. Um, just what have the conversations been like about what type of potential you all have and the ability to kind of shake back from some things, fight through some things? Oh, yeah, so we, we trying to go to the ship, you know. We um, we got a good, unbelievable squad, you know. We we work hard for it, so we going straight to the ship. Uh, take me through some of your off-season overall uh, in terms of some things maybe you were working on and, uh, and trying to really improve on as well as maybe if you had a chance to get some camps and some visits. Oh, yes, like sir. I've been uh, just came back in, in June. I came back from LSU visit. Uh, I've been to all kind of camps. I've been to Alabama camp. I went to LSU's camp, and I went to uh, Tulane's camp. How did that feel after 15 months of it all being locked down? Uh, man, it felt amazing. You know, people, uh, I'm one of the fastest uh, corners in the country, so people really want to see my speed, and I just got to show it to them. What did you get out there and run at some of those opportunities? What was like? I, guess uh, the I ran a four four two at Tulane, and then I came back and ran a four four three at LSU. What have been some of the things that you've focused on work wise this off season too, as you continue to try and? Oh yes, sir. Just uh, being a confident corner, being having that swagger, you know, that I can play any any coverage I want and man press it don't matter. Coming through Westgate, y'all aren't just like born with that swag. Oh like, man, we, <laughs> you know, that's that's kind of our thing. You know, we got uh, we got unbelievable guys, Danny Lewis. We got uh, Derek Williams. You know, including like just my brothers. You know, we help each other, push each other to be the person we are today. What's the outlook for you guys this fall when y'all get back into tackle mode here in a month? Oh, uh, you know, we we go bang each other a lot because man, we've been we've been not having pass on, but we will keep each other safe and ready to play our first game. Anything else that you want, whether it be like fans or college coaches that may see it, to know about about you or your Blaze team or this Westgate team or just kind of any kind oh, yes, of messages? Sir. Well, me personally, you know, I'm a cover corner. I could play any coverage. You know, I'm versatile. I could play safety, a nickel. It doesn't matter. You know, I have that speed. I have that legitimacy. You know, I can I can play anything you want, and I, I feel like I'm a great. Uh, any school I'll go to, I feel like I'll be a great person for. What should they know about your EPS Blaze group? Uh, we are an unbelievable team. Y'all, you really should watch us. You know, we, we have unbelievable guys with a ton of offers, you know. And when it comes time for that fall, what is uh, what is it going to look like on Friday nights for, for Westgate fans or opposing uh, fans that come to town? It's going to be a movie. We're going to put on a movie.